Hey, I'm NipFX, but you can call me Nikolai, and today we're going to do something entirely different. Not Java, not even technology, but we're going to stay nerdy. So I just came home from Vox CERN, which was amazing by the way, and look what I found. So we're going to unpack this. That, that's it, that's the video. We're going to unpack a board game. Oh right, I didn't tell you. Cyberpunk 2077, Gangs of Night City, is a board game. I ordered it like... I think July 2022 was when the Kickstarter began. And I've been waiting for it ever since. So yeah, I'm super looking forward to it. Um, am I, will I be doing uh, uh, unpacking videos now? No. Will I be doing board game reviews now? No, no, no. None of that. I just want to share this with you because I've been so excited about this game for a long time now that I thought I just, I can't just do it on my own. I can't just unpack it on my own. We need to do this together. So that's what we're doing now. I put a link to the Spotify playlist down there uh, where I have all my favorite Cyberpunk 2077 soundtrack songs in there. So you could listen to that while watching the video in the background. I, I would love to do that right now. Oh, okay. So I got like all the extensions because I'm an idiot. Who, who gets all the extensions for a game? Ooh, Pan Am. That they never played. I don't know. It's a Kickstarter. I have no choice. Okay, that's all the stuff. Also, I haven't played this. So you could play this game digitally. Uh, and I did that one and a half years ago, a couple times, but not since. So I don't even know what all the things are anymore. Let's see. Ugh, so that's the main box. That looks, that will look good in my thingy over there. Oh crap. I'm just thinking now this, like, so there's a camera up there. It might be all terribly out of focus. Because like it has shitty autofocus. Ugh, let's get this stuff out. So what else do we have? That's the base box, I think. The gang, gang Wars extension pack, I think has extra gangs. Remember correctly. The Families and Outcasts expansion pack has, I think the, 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 uh, the folks in the surrounding areas of Night City. Then we have 3D hideouts and drones, right? So they, instead of like this, this nasty little like paper thingies that you have to place on the board, I got this thing. More cars, because sure, or I think even cars at all actually. And the last one is Psychic. I don't know what, what that one is. Oh, and I think it's just more, uh, more what are called heroes? No, they're not called heroes. Man, I forgot all the vernacular. More runners. So originally I'm a cyberpunk the genre fan because of Shadowrun. So I think of runners when I see many of these folks. Okay, should we start with something? Should we unpack something more? Right, yeah we do. Let's start with the base box. Let's see what it has to offer. Yeah. Plastic. Ooh. Oh, I love that. The, the font is erased a bit and feels different. Anyway, oh! I was supposed to do this. So I talked to my daughter who's observing me from over there about this and she told me I need to get artificial fingernails and do this because that's what the TikTok generation does nowadays for unpacking videos. Come on. Clearly I'm not part of that generation though. Okay, so we have more content free. Uh-huh, come on. That's definitely, I definitely need to read the manual again because that's a long time ago. I wonder whether there are any changes. Um, so yeah, so I play board games once a week, tonight actually, but we're not going to play it tonight because I have to study the rules again. Um, I don't want to bore the rest of the group with me having to learn the rules on the fly. Okay, so these are some of, these are the gangs that are in there. Maelstrom, Valentinos, the default gangs, right? Voodoo Boys, Tiger Claws, Sixth Street, and that is that. A gazillion markers, some of which will be replayed replaced by the 3D hideouts and drones pack, I think. I need a larger table. Oh, I need a larger table, I'm afraid. Um, that is larger than I expected, somewhat. Shit, this is huge. The gang's here. I'm not gonna bore you with like unclicking all of these thingies here. It's gonna take a while. Fresh book smell mixed with some fresh plastic smell though, I have to admit. Let's look what's in here. 
Ooh. Oh, right. Yeah, sure. The gangs have figurines. Uh, yeah, clearly. So what do we have here? So that's Maelstrom and uh, I guess yellow was the Valentinos and the other gangs are here. And then these are the runners. Look, they have some cars. Oh, nice. That's a car you buy in the intro, right? Ooh, who's that guy? Huh. Takemura, I think. Yeah, that looks like Takemura. Ah, Johnny Silverhand. Nice, you can hire him as well. Good, good, good. Okay. Now, what, what do we do next? Let's see what the other gangs are about. I'm really curious to see. Eh, come on. Okay. Clearly more drones and more gangs. Do we have the mocks? The animals? And the scavengers. And the cool thing is I think these follow, sli like not slightly, but like somewhat different rules. Like they have different mechanics, I should say. Than the, than the original gangs, as far as I remember. Let's look into the Hydals and Drones pack. I, I wanted to listen to the Cyberpunk soundtrack, by the way, while I'm packing this. But then I couldn't cut the video that easily and also copyright. And nye, 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 nye. So I put it, you know what I'll do? I should have said that at the beginning of the video, probably. Maybe I'll cut this into the beginning of the video. I put a link to the Spotify playlist down there. Okay, so this is a bunch of stuff that replaces, so this is a drone, this is a, you can see the drone here, and that would be replaced by one of these fuckers, I guess, for example. Um, so this is the pack where you get more tactile things to play with, and this is, the, these are the hideouts, so the 6th street, I presume, the Valentinos, so you can place these hideouts, I think this is also like this, I think originally these like building looking things are the hideouts. Um, but then you can place these, which just like feels better, I guess. So the reason, by the way, why I went all in on this is not only because I'm crazy, it's also because I know from playing Terraforming Mars a lot that this really makes a difference. It really, like the game has a different feel if you place like th these 3D printed plastic pieces versus just paper stuff. You know, of course, like painted metal figurines would be even better. But who has time to paint figurines? Like nowadays, you know, when you're grown up, like I... That just sounds like... Impossible, basically. Okay, let's have a look at side gigs. It's just more gigs and more runners, I guess? Hmm, these are fixers. What else we got? Motor pool, more cars, and then we have families and outcasts. Let's do families and outcasts. I'm really looking forward to this. Oh, and Panama as well. Let's see what the other gangs look like. And this one has additional gangs too. So I guess like when we start out, we're probably gonna start with the base gangs, and then we're gonna add these other gangs over time once we know, know the game a little better. Oh yeah, right. You can add the Badlands like, oh, I forgot about that. You can add the Badlands as, as part of the map. So you can put this uh, here, I guess. Or well, you could, if you had a large enough table. Boom, and now you got the Badlands. And the corresponding uh, families, which are, from roll, uh, the Alicados, obviously, and then the rafts. Nice. Okay. Oh man, I'm already mixing things up. I'm gonna watch the video in reverse, Gesundheit, to, uh, to see how this stuff fits back together. Okay, motor pack, that's the last one. Then I'm gonna let you go. So, so looking forward to playing this. So originally, so not many of you may know this, but I'm not actually 23 uh, or 27 or 35 years old. No, I turned 40 last year and uh, in, uh, over the summer. And so when I, when I joined the Kickstarter and paid this exorbitant amount of money for this game that I, never, that I only played digitally, I thought, you know what, that's gonna be my birthday present for my 40th birthday. So it was supposed to come out mid last year. And since then, I've been waiting for the email for this to arrive. Oh yeah, and then I get the mail late last week, a few days before I leave for a conference, and UPS is like, we're gonna deliver on Monday. I'm like, I'm not there on Monday. And I hope they don't try to deliver it a couple times, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then I'm not home, and then they don't hand it out, and then it's gone again. I was like going paranoid. What they did instead is, very cool, they just put it into the hallway of the building. 
which is not great because it's a publicly accessible building. I was really worried that by the time I arrived today, it wouldn't be there anymore, but it was. One of my neighbors put it closer to my flat. What's this? Oh, it's a vehicle market. Oh yeah, right, oh so yeah. So we opened, I opened the motor pool. So apparently you can buy vehicles. Uh, they seem to be optional then, I take it. These are fucking huge though, holy shit. That's a hover tank. I think it's an armored troop transporter, but still. Some nice cars, the bird beater. Uh, and I think there's like a garbage truck or something. And a bike. Nice, so I guess, I guess those helps you to get around town faster, right? Okay. Oh, Pan Am. How could we forget Pan Am? Last thing. There we go. Wait, shouldn't there be like a card for her as well? Oh, there it is. Pan Am Palmer. Nice. So I think that's what that that's the video. I don't. I, it's a weird one. I get it. Uh, <laughs> no idea whether I'm going to end up publishing this. To be honest. <laughs> Holy shit, man! This is a lot of game, though. I'm really looking forward to this. I wish we could play it tonight, but we can't. Like I have to study the rules. Maybe I can. Maybe I can just read the rules instead of editing the video, and then we can play it. No, no, no. I like to. Ideally, even I like to do like a solo play here, just to you know wrap my head around all the rules so that I can really explain them well. Anyway, I had a lot of fun. Hope you did too. Have a good time. So long.